I'm back again guys, time to play some more desktop dungeons. Oh, like I said last time, the only place that we have left to, left to go is the Badlands. I figure let's just jump right in, we don't have anything else, we only have 124 gold, so there's nothing more that we can do here. It's another easy one, and looks like we got another goat. Garbad, the whoa! Okay. <laughs> And human, and last time what did we get? We got the wizard. Magic sense can see locations of all glyphs from level start. All glyphs are small items. Glyphs cost negative one mana and donate ten conversion points to other conversions. Magic attunement starts with the... Oh, cool, so it starts with that burning one. That's awesome. Play. Oh, it looks kind of grassy in this place. End is wall, destroy the dungeon wall. Gain a temporary 20% physical boost. This effect will stack. Pick up some gold, get myself a potion. So I can automatically see right away where all the little magic things are going to be at. Cool. Another end is wall. Do I have more storage? Oh, I can actually store them up here. Oh, that's cool. So I can convert that. Oh, I sense that there's a goat nearby. Let's take this guy down. Oh, why the heck didn't I burn him right away? Boom. There we go, restore up my health. Oh, got a goblin on their foot. Goosh and die. Another goblin. How many times can I cast this? How much is it? Five. So I can actually cast this thing twice before attacking. Let me get my man mana and health back up. What is this one? Get in there! Grants your first strike next combat round and 5% dodge chance. More attack up. Awesome. Health. Ooh, what are you? Zombie. Oh, yet again. Why am I not burning him? There we go. It gets the job done. End this wall. What are you? Oh, man. I didn't realize I was that close to death. Or is it just that he's that strong? Okay, he's just that strong and my health is that low. Yeah, holy crap. This guy doesn't have much health at all. Should actually be quite careful. <laughs> this guy should be an easy takedown. Burn him again. And take him down. Level 2. Grab my gold. I've been around since desktop dungeons alpha and I'm still gonna kick your ass. Just let me one land one hit. Regards, Garbold the whoa. He's he's a goat boss. And yeah, I think he's going to kill me if I let him hit me. That's a lot of damage he's pulling. Okay, this guy will be an easy one-hit KO. Kaboom! Just exploding in a blaze of fire. Oop, I don't want to use a potion. Oh, you can actually drag him around too. That's cool. I don't need another one of these, so I'm just going to convert it. Let's see. Sign. Dungeon Hit Writer's Guild Memo Number 5. To destroy items and convert them into stat boosts. Wait. To destroy items? Okay. Click on and drag items to the conversion box. Okay, that's... Yeah, I know that already. That's simple stuff. Um... I don't really want to try and take him down quite yet. Oh, I guess I can grab that. I don't know why I didn't do it before. More health. Yes. That's what I need. I might as well just... Oh, I actually do get damage. Should have burned him. Such a fool. Burning him up. Let's see, we got a meat man. I got a zombie hiding away in this corner here. 22 health. How much does my fireball hit for? Was that 8? Yeah, that's 8. Sure, I'll f 
I'll throw a couple fireballs at the zombie. Oh, I only got enough for one. Kill him the rest of the way. Oh, I got a mage in the corner. Regenerate my mana. I've been going through a lot of mana. But I suppose I am a wizard, so... Goosh. And one more. Boom. You're toast. Zombie munchies. Aw, oh, dang it. Um, what if I convert this? Does that actually... What does that do? Your current conversion points. Humans get a 10... Okay, so that's for... I get my 10% attack bonus. On. Oh, I'm really that close to death. Holy crap. Go back. Run away. If I come back, I should be able to just burn him in the face. Take him out. Level up. Got another get in there. Oh crap, I didn't mean to hit that. So does that mean... Grants your first strike in the next combat and 50% dodge. Okay, so... I get my two fireballs. And I get first strike. Cool. That's pretty nifty. I just watched that little mana orb just go... Swirl around. Um, let's go to the goblin first. Or should I just take out the wood? Oh, what the heck? Oh, well, I guess that's one way of doing something. It's weird. I just like held down and it showed up. Um, these guys are level four, so let's see. They hit for twenty-one. That really packs a punch. But. I think I could actually take one down pretty easy if I just fireball him a few times. Yeah, I should be able to just punch him now. Level 4. Hey man, hiding in the corner stands no chance. Just toast right from the start. Let me get some more health. Ooh. I'm starting to run out of spaces to go here and more stronger enemies. Will I be able to take him out? Should be able to. I don't have much here. Oh yeah. Easy. Oh, there's a stupid warlock hiding down there as well. Go over here. Doo -doo -doo. Goblin. Oh, I can, get, I can just take him down. There's a little weak goblin hiding guarding him as well. Um, how close am I? I'm gonna go heal up a little bit. Go fireball a mage while I'm at it. Oh, little extra health thing hiding there in the shadows. How wonderful. Um, I'm gonna burn you. How much damage is it doing? 16 damage. How much health do you got? So I could kill you in two fireballs or I could just take him down. I'm gonna go take the warlock down first. Oh, I don't actually have enough mana for two fireballs. Oh, I should be able to knock him the rest of the way. Now I think I'm starting to exhaust this top layer of recovering stuff, so I'm gonna go down this passage. Gold! Now let's see. The feeling of using. Is this end of small? Yeah. Oh yeah, look at all this loot. Just getting all that money. There's a lot of money, holy crap. I'm gonna be rich once I get out of here. I can actually buy a whole crap ton of stuff. Wonder. Is there one more wall past this one? Nope, that's the edge there. Let's come back up. So, kill the zombie or kill the grumpy goblin? I'm gonna kill that zombie, it's a little bit tougher. Burn! Okay, he actually takes a beating. Um, I really don't want to use up my pots right now. But man, they really hit hard. I can hit him one KO. Awesome, leveled up. I should be able to go and take him out. Let's see. How much 
I get 20 damage with my Burnder Eyes. How much health does he have? 81. So all I need is 4 of those. No, 5 of them, actually. Can I manage 5? I hope so. 1, 2. If I heal up, I'll get my mana back up. Be my third. You're toast! Just burned to bits. I'm gonna kill that guy just for the hell of it. <laughs> and I'm gonna claim my trophy. I just realized how weird he looks. He looks like he's on crack. He's got his tongue hanging out as well. He's like, whoa! Killed the goat, then killed the goblin. Poor goblin. He could have escaped, but he couldn't. There we go, 220 gold. Should be able to do some stuff. Oh, what the heck? Well, this is a little weird glitch, but I'm going to go with it. Congratulations. You've dealed with the three terrible goats. Lords of the surrounding dungeons and your kingdom breeze of a collective sigh. Unfortunately, you're running up against a new kind of problem. As you take the spoils of your hero's dungeon exploits back to the kingdom treasure vault, you notice that it's becoming a teensy bit full. Well, that's that's a problem. You don't want a full treasure vault. One guy comes along, he'll just be able to steal it all. Granted, he'd be, get, be able to get in there. It's time for the official vault to expand beyond the confines of the old couch in your spare bedroom. Are we really keeping all our money in an old couch? Oh, wow. For now, you'll need to focus on finding a better source of cash security and hiding in random spots across the town. Simply won't do. Rumors around the town, uh, around the, in the local tavern, that mysterious creatures known as bankers, <laughs> man, those bankers, they're really mysterious creatures, have been sighted in these realms. If you catch one, maybe you'll you can harness its power in some way. New dungeons! Yay! Trophy sold! 150 gold. Quest unlock. Field reports say that a well-dressed creature has been sighted in the den of danger. Alleg allegedly trying to assess its value on the real estate market. <laughs> it's said to be somewhat magic resistant and very prone to financial gar jargon. Challenge and defeat the banker roaming here. We may be able to unlock some of its finance. Finance. I'm, I don't even know how that pronouns that word. Secrets. Quest unlock. Venture capital. Although Venture Cave is well known as a gathering point for deadly venture slaying beasties, it also tends to be a meeting point for dubiously dubious dealers and good smugglers. Trackers are almost certain that you'll find a banker wandering around here challenge and defeat it get rid of this thing go back in here there's a hand it's just like pointing yeah this is a really weird glitch it's like it thought that the town was supposed to be here but it's not it's trying to point to where something would be but I don't have that page now that you're going further afield quests and dungeons are becoming accessible from the map screen click on the tavern to yeah well, I'll be back in a little bit, guys. I was planning on doing another one later today. But first, I gotta figure out how to fix this little glitch that happened. Well, I'll see you guys later. Hope you guys enjoyed, and leave a like and comment all you want. I will be sure to look at them whenever I can. See you guys later. Bye!